In the extraordinary spreading out of the cutting-edge universe, people have long debated whether we're alone. We've gazed at the stars, studied the grand designs of galaxies, and speculated on the potential for life beyond our little blue planet. That potential has finally come to fruition. Recently, NASA's chief analyst revealed that the James Webb Space Telescope, our window to the universe, has detected something remarkable. Prepare yourself. On the edges of our incomprehensible time, a phenomenal secret has been uncovered. Life has been perceived on a world known as Proxima b, and it changes everything. The investigation of the atmospheres of exoplanets that transit their stars compels us as we uncover the secrets revealed by the James Webb Telescope and consider what the discovery of life on Proxima b could mean for the future of space exploration and all humankind. The James Webb Space Telescope is a marvel that contributes to changing how we interpret the universe. The telescope's high-level construction, combined with its exceptional position in space, gives scientists an unparalleled perspective on the universe. Moreover, it allows them to focus on faraway cosmic structures, planets, and stars in a manner that was never possible before. This might seem like a lot of empty claims, but it actually has the technology to make all of that real. One of JWST's most critical abilities is its primary mirror, which measures 6.5 meters in width. This is over two times the size of the primary mirror on the Hubble Space Telescope, which has been one of the most crucial tools for space exploration in recent years. With such a gigantic mirror, JWST can capture the smallest glimmers of light from the farthest reaches of the universe, elements that the realm of science hasn't always had the option to see. Scientists have long speculated about what lies beyond the restrictions of a conventional telescope, but with this one, they can at long last see the genuine details they've been dreaming about. This time, it's not only its enormous mirror. The JWST is outfitted with a suite of cutting-edge instruments capable of detecting a tremendous range of light frequencies. The near-infrared camera, NIRCAM, as it's usually called, is a powerful asset designed to capture images in the near-infrared region of the electromagnetic spectrum. Why is that significant? Well, near-infrared light can penetrate dust and mist that block visible light, permitting us to see further into the vast depths of space. NERCOM's high-resolution imaging capabilities give space experts an unmatched view to inspect the development of stars and galaxies. This astounding instrument's primary objectives include focusing on the early universe and its ancient light, examining the arrangement and development of galaxies, and distinguishing and characterizing exoplanets. The detailed pictures captured by NIRCAM reveal hidden details and structures that were previously inaccessible to telescopes. It enables us to perceive how large-scale frameworks shape and evolve over time, providing insights into the mysterious processes that shape our vast space and beyond. However, that's only one tool. There's also the near-infrared spectrograph, NIRSpec, and the mid-infrared instrument, MIRI, which take the investigation of stars and cosmic systems to an unprecedented level. By separating the light emitted by celestial objects into its component colors or frequencies, this technique, known as spectroscopy, provides vital information about the chemical composition, temperature, and structure of these objects enhancing scientists' ability to explore the inner workings of stars and galaxies. It gives scientists precise insights into everything it examines. Focusing on the absorption and emission lines in the spectra allows researchers to determine the elements present in a star or gas cloud, revealing the building blocks of our universe. This information enables us to comprehend the life cycles of stars, the formation of galaxies, and the complex interactions between these celestial bodies. Furthermore, NIRSpec plays a critical role in the study of distant high-redshift galaxies. These galaxies emit light that has traveled billions of years to reach us, providing a glimpse into the origins of the universe. Exploring their spectra helps astronomers determine their chemical composition, age, and other characteristics, shedding light on the universal evolution of galaxies throughout cosmic history. Regarding the mid-infrared region of the electromagnetic spectrum, the mid-infrared instrument, MIRI, on the JWST has been explicitly designed to examine objects emitting infrared radiation at longer wavelengths. This capability allows us to explore various phenomena, from the formation of stars to the detection of exoplanet atmospheres. One of MIRI's primary goals is to study the dusty regions where stars are conceived. 
Infrared radiation can penetrate these dense dust clouds, allowing Miri to peer through the astronomical dimness and witness the birth of stars and planetary systems. It captures detailed images and spectra in the mid-infrared range, offering astronomers critical insights into the processes occurring within these celestial nurseries. However, that's not all. Miri also plays a significant role in the quest for and characterization of exoplanets. It does so by observing in the mid-infrared, allowing Miri to detect and analyze the faint thermal emissions of exoplanet atmospheres. This capability opens up valuable opportunities for studying the composition, temperature, and characteristics of exoplanets, including their potential habitability. Miri's observations help us determine the presence of water vapor, carbon dioxide, and other key molecules that could indicate the conditions necessary for life. These are just the components that could support life. How does the James Webb Telescope search for indications of something occurring beneath the surface? Two of the primary techniques it utilizes are spectroscopy and transit observations. At the core of this work lies spectroscopy, a method that permits researchers to analyze the light emitted or absorbed by an object to determine its composition. With regards to exoplanets, spectroscopy helps us interpret the atomic secrets hidden within their atmospheres. When the JWST focuses on an exoplanet, it eagerly awaits a transit event a remarkable event where the exoplanet passes before its host star from our viewpoint. As this happens, the JWST simply observes the starlight passing through the exoplanet's atmosphere during the transit. Equipped with its advanced instruments, the JWST captures this vital light with NIR spec succeeding in the near-infrared range, while Miri takes charge in the mid-infrared. Together, they form a dynamic duo covering a wide scope of frequencies fundamental for in-depth investigation. You might be wondering what's the big deal about capturing starlight during a transit. Well, this starlight contains essential information about the exoplanet's atmospheric composition. As the light passes through the exoplanet's atmosphere, it interacts with different particles present, leaving specific fingerprints or molecular signatures on the starlight. The JWST then meticulously analyzes the filtered light using its spectroscopic capabilities. Scientists can identify specific molecules present in the exoplanet's atmosphere by analyzing the absorption or emission lines in the light spectrum. Each molecule has its unique set of spectral features, so they simply need to be pinned down and listed to piece the whole story together accurately. To get precise results, the JWST conducts extensive modeling and analysis. It relies on complex simulations and reference spectra of known molecules to match the observed spectral features with their corresponding atomic identities. Think of it like cross-referencing a celestial dictionary to decipher the exoplanet's atmospheric language. Distinguishing the presence of specific molecules is only the beginning. The search for signs of something going on deep down requires a more nuanced approach. Scientists search for molecules considered biomarkers substances that could be associated with life. These biomarkers could include gases like oxygen, methane, and water vapor, elements essential for supporting life on Earth. However, more insights and data are needed to assess the overall habitability and potential signs of organic activity. To enhance the search for life, the JWST supplements its spectroscopic capabilities with other observational techniques I in the vast domain of the universe, People have long questioned whether we're alone. We've looked at the stars, examined distant universes, and embarked on a quest to discover the potential for life beyond our small blue planet. That potential has at long last been realized. NASA's chief recently revealed that the James Webb Space Telescope, our window to the universe, has found something remarkable. Prepare yourself. On the edges of our vast timeline, a fantastic mystery has been revealed. Life has been sighted on a world called Proxima b, and it changes everything. The investigation of the atmospheres of exoplanets that transit their stars obliges us as we uncover the secrets revealed by the James Webb Telescope and consider what the discovery of life on Proxima b could mean for the possible future of space exploration and all humanity. The James Webb Space Telescope is a scientific marvel that promises to change how we interpret the universe. The telescope's sophisticated technology, coupled with its unique role in space, gives scientists an unprecedented view of the universe. It allows them to focus on distant cosmic structures, planets, 
and stars in a way that has never been possible before. This may sound like a lot of empty claims, but it has the technology to make all of that real. One of JWST's most impressive features is its primary mirror, which measures 6.5 meters in diameter. This is over two times the size of the primary mirror on the Hubble Space Telescope, which has been one of the most significant tools for space exploration in recent years. With such a massive mirror, the JWST can capture the faintest glint of light from the farthest parts of the universe, elements that science has not always been able to see. Scientists have long speculated about what lies beyond the boundaries of a conventional telescope, but with this one, they can at last see the real details they've been longing for. This time, it's not just its huge mirror. The JWST is equipped with an array of state-of-the-art instruments capable of detecting a wide variety of light frequencies. The Near-Infrared Camera, NIRCAM, as it's commonly known, is a crucial tool designed to capture images in the near-infrared region of the electromagnetic spectrum. This is significant because near-infrared light can penetrate dust and gas that block visible light, allowing us to see deeper into space. NERCAM's high-resolution imaging capabilities provide an unparalleled view for studying the formation of stars and galaxies. Its primary objectives include focusing on the early universe and its ancient light, examining the structure and evolution of galaxies, and identifying and characterizing exoplanets. The detailed images captured by NIRCAM reveal hidden structures and phenomena that were previously inaccessible to telescopes, helping us understand how large-scale systems form and evolve over time. However, NIRCAM is just one of JWST's instruments. There's also the Near Infrared Spectrograph, NIRSpec, and the Mid Infrared Instrument, MIRI, which take the study of stars and cosmic systems to new heights. Spectroscopy the technique of breaking down light into its component colors or wavelengths provides crucial information about the chemical composition, temperature, and structure of celestial objects. By analyzing the absorption and emission lines in the spectra, researchers can determine the elements present in a star or gas cloud, revealing the building blocks of our universe. This information enables scientists to understand the life cycles of stars, the formation of galaxies, and the interactions between celestial bodies. NIRSpec plays a critical role in studying distant high-redshift galaxies. These galaxies emit light that has traveled billions of years to reach us, offering a glimpse into the universe's origins. Analyzing their spectra helps astronomers determine their chemical composition, age, and other characteristics, shedding light on the universal evolution of galaxies. In the mid-infrared region, MIRI is specifically designed to study objects emitting infrared radiation at longer wavelengths. This capability allows us to explore phenomena such as the formation of stars and the detection of exoplanet atmospheres. One of MIRI's primary goals is to study the dusty regions where stars are born. Infrared radiation can penetrate these dense dust clouds, allowing MIRI to observe the birth of stars and planetary systems. It captures detailed images and spectra in the mid-infrared range, providing critical insights into the processes occurring within these celestial nurseries. MIRI also plays a significant role in the search for and characterization of exoplanets by observing in the mid-infrared range. This enables it to detect and analyze the faint thermal emissions of exoplanet atmospheres, providing valuable opportunities for studying their composition, temperature, and potential habitability. MIRI's observations help us detect the presence of water vapor, carbon dioxide, and other key molecules that could indicate conditions suitable for life. The James Webb Telescope searches for signs of life using two primary techniques, spectroscopy and transit observations. Spectroscopy allows scientists to analyze the light emitted or absorbed by an object to determine its composition. For exoplanets, Spectroscopy helps interpret the molecular secrets within their atmospheres. During a transit event, when an exoplanet passes in front of its host star from our viewpoint, JWST observes the starlight passing through the exoplanet's atmosphere. Equipped with advanced instruments, JWST captures this crucial light with NIR spec excelling in the near-infrared range while MIRI covers the mid-infrared region. Together, they form a dynamic duo, essential for in-depth analysis. Capturing starlight during a transit is crucial because it contains essential information about the exoplanet's atmospheric composition. As the light passes through the exoplanet's atmosphere, 
it interacts with different molecules, leaving specific fingerprints or molecular signatures on the light. JWST meticulously analyzes this filtered light using its spectroscopic capabilities to identify specific molecules in the exoplanet's atmosphere. Each molecule has a unique set of spectral features, which scientists match with known reference spectra to decipher the atmospheric composition. Detecting specific molecules is only the beginning. The search for signs of life involves identifying biomarkers, substances potentially associated with life, such as oxygen, methane, and water vapor. However, more data are needed to assess the overall habitability and potential signs of biological activity. To enhance the search for life, JWST supplements its spectroscopic capabilities with other observational techniques. Advanced imaging instruments like NIRCAM and MIRI capture high-resolution images of exoplanets and their surroundings, providing valuable context and additional data. By studying surface features, atmospheric dynamics, and potential biosignatures, scientists gain a comprehensive understanding of an exoplanet's habitability. Furthermore, JWST collaborates with ground-based observatories and other space telescopes for multi-wavelength observations. This coordinated effort allows scientists to gather data across different parts of the electromagnetic spectrum, enhancing the accuracy and reliability of their findings. For instance, ground-based telescopes like the Extremely Large Telescope, ELT, and the Giant Magellan Telescope, GMT, offer complementary observations in visible and near-infrared light, refining our understanding of exoplanetary atmospheres. Combining all these observational techniques and data sources creates a robust framework for searching for signs of life on exoplanets. It is a meticulous process involving careful analysis, cross-referencing, and global scientific collaboration. The advanced capabilities and cutting-edge technology of JWST bring us closer to answering one of humanity's most profound questions. Are we alone in the universe? As JWST continues its mission, the search for life on exoplanets like Proxima B remains an exciting journey. The potential discovery of extraterrestrial life would revolutionize our understanding of the universe and our place within it, opening new avenues for scientific exploration, technological advancements, and philosophical contemplation. The James Webb Space Telescope represents a leap forward in our ability to explore the cosmos and search for signs of life moving us closer to unraveling the mysteries of the universe and unlocking the secrets of life beyond Earth.